So golf balls are traditionally white. And Callaway have probably the widest range of funky golf balls that there is out there right now. But what I wanna know is, are they just pretty patterns or do they actually help you play better golf? Now the first thing you're gonna have to do is make some choices, true viz. 360 triple track good old standard triple track 360 fade another bit of truth is plenty of options there and first of all the thing to recognize is before the patterns these are in terms of callaway chrome soft in terms of erc soft are very good golf balls but the big question remains is the pattern on these golf balls going to help me score any lower or help me in any way in my performance on the golf course. Now, I absolutely love this new 360 fade on the ERC Soft, and I also like the 360 triple track in terms of, well, two things really. One is the obvious one, and that's in terms of an alignment aid for putts. And the second being to act as a training aid for putts as well, because what these lines or alignment does is it encourages a pretty much a forward roll, if you like, make sure you're imparting some topspin. And if you stroke the putt correctly, you'll see the cycle of the path in terms of that alignment will uh, repeat over and over again if you're getting that put wrong and you start to see that crossover then you're impacting some form of side spin on your put which is never good and both of those puts did exactly as i had intended set them off on the right line set them out with a little bit of forward top spin and unfortunately i just didn't hit either of them quite hard enough so that's a real positive but the issue I have is that with somebody who would consider to them maybe a little bit of uh, OCD in their game, a situation like this where I, the flag is pointing that way, my alignment aid is pointing that way, when I get these at address, it's throwing me out slightly and not something that I am particularly comfortable with. And both of them all of a sudden seem to be working against my eye line. That's not to say we can't get the ball going towards the hole, but from a visual perspective, sit down ball, there is a slight piece of trickery on the eye, which causes me a few problems. And that's not just from the fringe, the same would be said in the fairway. The only other position that I have control about my alignment is off the tee, when again, I would be very much pointing that in the direction that I'm aiming. So what happens when I swap out my 360 triple track and I put a true viz in its place in terms of my putting alignment well what it does it still runs a very strong black line through the um, the middle of those shapes either side those four shapes that I'm looking down on and present first of all a very strong alignment aid in terms of putting But the bonus for me with the Truvis pattern is because it is not a uh, sort of symmetrical pattern all the way around, then I've got something that's now sitting at the side of the green in this case that doesn't need to be perfectly aligned to not work against my eye line and my vision. Well, that'd be good if that went in. Well, it's a damn good effort, but it really does change things up. And obviously that would apply to where the ball landed on the fairway as well. But of course, pushing the practical elements to one side in terms of these, the performance of these golf balls, we've also got to acknowledge just how much fun they are. They look pretty funky. And in my opinion, 
probably would appeal to a younger audience. And there's nothing wrong with that. But the bottom line is these are a premium golf ball, premium in terms of performance, but also premium in terms of price. And you make your own decisions as whether or not which ball might be suitable or not for your game. But either way, I can't deny that the patterns on all of these golf balls are really interesting in my opinion. And in terms of practice, they actually make it a little bit more fun and enjoyable. And that's not something you'll often hear from me. And you know what they say, 